I want to acknowledge the faculty who deliver the learning experiences that culminate in this moment. Without them, this occasion of celebration would not be possible. Next, our staff who are committed to providing both leadership and service for the college. They work hard to make sure students and the rest of us have the services and support we need to carry out our mission. So the faculty and staff of the college all please stand and receive our recognition and appreciation. I would also like to call to attention some special guests we have in the audience. With us today are some important community leaders who support the college in significant ways. We also have in attendance individuals who volunteer their time and resources to serve on the college's program advisory boards, the Dean's Advisory Council, and the college's development board. Donors to the college, local legislators, and colleagues for the Great Falls College School District. These individuals help provide resources and guide the direction of the college, its programs, and curricula. They represent the community we serve. Please join me in thanking our special guests for their support of and service to Great Falls College of Institute. I'd like to now introduce our platform guests and ask that each person stand as I call his or her name. Please hold your applause until the last person is introduced. Dr. John Seth, Deputy Commissioner for Two Year Community College Education. Our commencement speaker, Lieutenant Governor Andrew Lee, who will be introduced more formally later in the program. Dr. Susan Poole, CEO and Dean of Great Falls College at MSU. Dr. Sue Gibson, MSU Learner, Education Faculty. Tim Reese, our student speaker. Dr. Frankie Lyons, Director of Science Division. Dr. Ruth Falkbaker, Director of Business, Trades and Technology Division. Ms. Dan Cross, Director of Development, Education and Transfer Division. Of course, Matt Sherry. So let us Great Falls College and MSU students. Please give these folks a round of applause. <laughs> On behalf of the college, my special thanks for the extra effort our visiting guests have made to join us in the platform party today. And all the sacrifices that you make to work with us every day, they are greatly appreciated. It is my pleasure now to call to the podium the Chief Executive Officer and Dean of Great Falls College and School, Dr. Susan Wall. Good morning. I look out across this. Um, to and uh, I'm just so filled with pride. It, it struck me the other day when I was talking with some of you that I won't see some of your faces again on our campus. And while I am so incredibly proud of all the work that you've done in here today, I'm also sad that I'm going to not see you in the hallway. So um, it's kind of a mixed emotion today for me. It is my distinct honor to share your celebration today as we recognize you, the 2014 graduating class of Great Falls College, Mount Texas State University. Today is about you and the history that you are making. With 384 graduates, you represent the largest graduating class in the college's history. That is so awesome. Sixty-seven of you are receiving multiple degrees. Twenty-nine are graduating with 4.0, 73 with high honors, and 67 receiving multiple degrees. And all of you are receiving 448 certificates of degrees and another historical benchmark for Great Falls College and MSU. Among you today are also graduates of MSU Northern who 
share this commitment and celebration. We are so honored to have you share this day with us. Thank you for being here. I would like to take a few moments to demonstrate to our audience the true perseverance that you have shown to meet your educational goals, complete your credentials, and have earned the title of graduate. For all of the graduates who have worked full time while completing your program of study, please stand. For well, those of you who are the first in your family to receive a college degree, please stand. For well, those of you who have raised children while you attended school, please stand. And for those of you who served in the armed forces and have a significant amount of employment while you have been in school, please stand. Cool. 
Grace Dunn, Joe Keel, Tom Oakford, Christopher Peck, Mark Plant, and Valerie Smith. They have instructed courses, their teaching techniques, and the delivery to better support the needs of our students and our programs. Would you all please give them one more round of applause? The second award is the Dean's Award for Teaching Excellence. The award recognizes one faculty member of the college who uniquely represents the quality of instruction and focus on the students found in Great Falls College and MSU. Using the criteria of instructional effectiveness and student-centeredness, the committee of students, faculty, and staff have selected Dr. Deborah Newton, Program Director and Faculty, and Medical Building and Coding as this year's board lead. While she is unable to be here today, let's please recognize Dr. Newton, the 2014 recipient of the Dean's Award for Teaching Excellence. Dr. Newton's program is 100% online, and she demonstrates that a faculty member can be actively involved with the campus as well as other students, no matter where one lives. Great Falls College NSU is a special place for our students, our faculty, and staff in the community. We are the community's two-year college, and we strive to ensure the needs of the community are met. We achieve this by being student-centered and responsive, and emphasizing quality in teaching and learning. Your graduation today is the culmination of those efforts. We are one of the eight units of the Montana University system. Like the other seven units, we fall under the guidance of the Montana Board of Regents and the coordination of the Office of the Commissioner of Higher Education. These implications are important to the Commissioner and to our regents. They have the honor and the difficulty of wanting to be at all campus commencement ceremonies, but that just isn't possible. They share our excitement and pride in you today. And on the other hand, the Office of the Commissioner of Regents, I am proud to introduce Dr. John Seth, Deputy Commissioner of Two-Year and Community College Education, to share some thoughts with us. Dr. Seth. Good morning, <coughs> Lieutenant Governor McLean, Dean Wolf, members of the platform party, faculty, staff, parents, family members, and most importantly, the graduating class of 2014. It is my sincere pleasure on behalf of the Board of Regents, the Commissioner of Higher Education, to provide you with a warm welcome and heartfelt congratulations for your incredible achievements. This is a great day for you. Great Falls College and MSU is a very special place with amazing faculty and staff dedicated to serving you every day. I would like to take a moment to recognize two of your students, Eva Mayo, a nursing student, and Stacy Longo, also a nursing student. Both Eva and Stacy were recognized by the Board of Regents at their March meeting as representing Montana as part of the All-Star Community College Junior College 2014 Phi Beta Kappa All-Academic Team. Stacy and Eva were nominated by the faculty and Great Falls College for membership into the Montana chapter of Phi Beta Kappa Honor Society. To receive an invitation to membership in my data academy, students must have a grade point average of 3.5 and must adhere to the standards of the society. Stacy and Emma meet those qualifications and go far beyond. Both are excellent examples of students who benefited from a comprehensive two-year institution such as Great Falls College. Stacy and Emma are non-traditional age students, over 21, which by the way is becoming the new traditional student across America, and are now on their way to begin to pursue their bachelor's degree this next year. Both Stacy and Emma exemplify the types of students our comprehensive two-year colleges serve in Montana 
and underscore the four-year degree pathway opportunity state provide. Please join me in providing a warm congratulatory applause to both Stacy and Ella for their incredible achievement and wish them well as they begin their bachelor's degree in nursing journey next fall with Montana State University. Finally, I would like to take this opportunity on behalf of the board members, commissioner, and Montana State University President Wadeh Kuzaga to personally thank you all, the faculty and staff of Great Falls College. These individuals work tirelessly to help support the goals and dreams of all the students at the college. I would also like to recognize the partnership Great Falls College has established with Great Falls Public Schools, where as you heard, 12 students will graduate today with their certificate of applied science and welding before they receive their high school diploma. Please know the Board of Regents, the Commissioner, and I are all very appreciative of this tremendous partnership effort and that we plan to replicate this partnership model across the state of Montana. <laughs> Graduates, congratulations to each of you for your hard work, treasure this day, and begin thinking about your next step in the life of the morning. Again, congratulations.
but Clay is an educator and a classroom teacher. She taught American history and government at Adam High School prior to being tapped as Lieutenant Gardner. In 2003, she was named the best high school teacher by the Montana Standard. She also served as the chair of the Montana Board of Regents prior to being appointed and previously served on the Montana Board of Public Education. Angela worked through high school as a waitress at a Blue Anchor Cafe and as a 1999 graduate from Bridges High School. She earned a bachelor's degree in 1994 from Western Montana College in Dillon, now the University of Montana Western, becoming the first member of her family to graduate from college. She went on to earn her Master of Arts in Curriculum and Instruction from the University of Montana in 2000, and in 2005 she became nationally board certified in Social Studies, History, Adolescence, and Young Adulthood. After graduating from Western Montana College, the play began her teaching career at our Lake School and Middle School. The play was also taught as an adjunct professor at Montana Tech, University of Montana in Butte. Please help me welcome our 2014 commencement speaker, Lieutenant Governor Daniel McLean.
that we have all the faculty who are able to be here with this day. And from the bottom of my heart, I want to thank each and every one of you who every day you come to campus in order to make sure that our students are successful. So I just want to thank our faculty again. Graduates of Great Falls College MSU and MSU Northern, this is the moment you've been waiting for. I would like to call Heidi Hassan to the podium and have her lead us in the presentation of candidates for their degrees. Dr. Hassan. Associate of Applied Science and Accounting, Applied Human Associate. 
things. Associate of Applied Science, Accounting Honors. Associate of Applied Science, Business Administration Management, also Honors. Char <laughs> Nonibai, Pathetic. Associate of Applied Science, Accounting Honors. Mason <laughs> Gilbert, Associate of Applied Science, Accounting Associate of Science, Business Administration Management. Jessica Ray Eaton, Associate of Applied Science, Business Administration Management, Honors. Brian Parker, Associate of Applied Science, Business Administration Management. Very good. Yeah. 
Great Falls College and MSU and MSU Garden programs, please rise. By the virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Regents of Higher Education of the State of Montana, I hereby confer upon each of you the degrees and certificates for which you are qualified. Graduates, you may now move your tassel from the right side to the left side of your board. So I Please meet your candidate graduate in Heritage Hall. 